Sometimes, even when you don't want to believe Fred Kajubi Lumbuye's information, but you are forced to. I think two weeks ago, Fred Kajubi Lumbuye said, we are going to see stories of bombs in different parts of the country. And guess what? This is already happening. Over the weekend, you saw the story of a bomb attack at Pastor Robert Kayanja's church, Rubaga Miracle Center. Kampala Metropolitan Police spokesperson Mr. Patrick Onyango said the bomb was made of nails, a motorcycle battery, a charger and telephone handset and the suspected terrorist was arrested. Now today, the same story has been reported in a place called Mavito, Natete side on Kampala Massacre Road. That place, as you can see in the pictures right there, has been cordoned off by police and UPDF. But when you read the comments on social media, I don't know why Ugandans are not believing the findings of the security. Many Ugandans are thinking this is comedy. Other people are saying President Museveni's government is looking for a way to disorganize His Excellency Robert Chagulanyi Suentamu, aka Bobby Wine's countrywide programs. It should be remembered that in 2021, we had the same stories of bomb explosions. You remember the bomb that exploded in a bus and one person was killed on spot and several others were critically injured. You also remember that bomb explosion in Komamboga right here in Kampala and Nyinaneza Emily, a waitress, died on spot and several others critically injured. That was also in 2021. Yes, so basically I'm trying to refresh your mind on these bomb stories. And uh, here we are again. Otherwise, we hope this issue is handled by security very quickly before we lose people. Yes, yeah, so that is the latest update I have for you on the Buzz UG right now. Subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Amel Milo, aka Fula. Don't forget to follow me the other side of TikTok. I'm using the same names, Mel Milo, aka Fula. It is a bye for now. Thank you. Audio jungle.